We sitting mad still right now. We are sitting mad still. And we up in here, we promoting social distancing. That's why I got on my mask. I don't have on one, but it's fine. I wash my hands. Anyway, man, we about to get straight into it today. Oh, it's something new. You can see us now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. You can so, see man. us. So, motherfuckers will know who to be mad at. Right. Now on. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. But we're going to get right into it, man. Everybody know what we about to do. Everybody seen it. This video got niggas acting like straight up bitches. This video got people putting out petitions to get people off of the video. It got niggas who made explicit shit in the past coming out saying they condemn it. Now, a nigga who I used to fuck with called CeeLo Green. Mm -hmm. And it got motherfucking senators in California saying they watched it by accident. Nigga, what? By accident. Like that's you don't that go and type that, in WAP on accident. That remind me of that fucking Dr. Dre and Eminem lyric. You know, mm-hmm. about oh she tripped and fell and landed <laughs> on his dick <laughs> from guilty conscience. That's this nigga right. tripped and fell and landed on his keyboard and his fucking face type wait, wait, WAP. WAP. W A P. Cardi B featuring Megan Thee Stallion. We about to react to this shit, man. We about to react to it. There's some O's in this house. There's some O's in this house. <laughs> Let's go. Let that thing play. Shit. Let's see. What we got here? What we got here? They got oh, butt bro, cheeks. Booties on the wall. Booties on the wall. Bro. Titties on the wall. Titties on the screen. <laughs> Titties everywhere. Bruh, I ain't never know I like the color yellow so much in my motherfucking life, bruh. That's a fact. Alright, alright. This all right. right here, don't this remind you of the Nicki Minaj Anaconda video? It does. Mm-hmm. This so part I, right here. I was thinking more of some damn Indiana Jones type shit. <laughs> <laughs> you're the only motherfucker in the world who will see this video and think about Harrison Ford, my nigga. This Let's get it. Looks like some <laughs> what the fuck are you talking Indiana about? Jones, Let's bro. go. My jam so hard. Put this cookie right in your face. Swipe your nose like a credit card. Hop on top. I want to ride. I do a kick. I'm going to ride. Look at my mouth. Look at my thighs. Sweat it is wet. Come to the thighs. Tie me up. Like I'm surprised. That's us roll play. I wear this I'll be damn, boy. Cut that big mad truck. Right in this little garage. Make me dream. But let me tell you, I got this ring. Hold on. Hold on. I just gotta. Okay, what you got? This verse? Different. Well, Megan the Stallion can fucking wrap her ass off. Number one, she remind me of Gangsta Boot. That's a fact. That's what she remind me of, but you and paused also, the video this part right at the perfect me section. Wonka. I mean, it this shit me right here remind Wonka. me of Goddamn, I love the color purple. <laughs> This is my favorite bitch. Right there. She doing the fucking tootsie roll. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, we about to pause this real quick, cause this is what got motherfuckers panties in the bunch also, man. Bruh. It has been petitions to get Kylie Jenner out of this video. Bruh, look. I don't know why, because I don't really see no reason or anything bad about it. Bruh, I know that what we looking at right now was purchased, alright? Facts. She went to the doctor, they sold them titties and lips <laughs> on... They sold that ass on. But motherfucker, I don't care. That's a fact. 
Okay. I do not give a fuck, nigga. Do you look at a nigga car with rims and say, you know, you, you know, we could gonna put a petition on to get you off the earth because you put rims on your on that charger that didn't come on it. Nigga, she put titties on that didn't come on the body. <laughs> so what all she did was get a couple modifications, my nigga. But Cardi B did stand up for Kylie Jenner. She just <laughs> said she's trying to show all like aspects of women, all color women. You know, mm-hmm. I understand it. I see it. <laughs> Bruh, ain't nothing wrong with her being in the video. She fine as fuck. Bruh, she might not have been fine as fuck if she didn't get surgically enhanced. <laughs> but I don't care. Think that leopard is real? Shit, I don't know, maybe. About as real as them titties. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I need a hard hit, I need a deep, I need a Henny drink, I need a smoke, not a garnish, nigga, I need a King Cobra with a hook in it, hope it lean over. The titties are out. <laughs> Let me get that out of the way. The titties are out. They're out. This is softcore porn. This is softcore porn. <laughs> but this is the thing, though. The titties is out, but the video, the audio was censored. Max. I was gonna get into that. See, let's pay some see, respects. This is my favorite part. Let's of pay some respects. Moment of silence. All right, all right. This is my favorite part of the video. Make you bust before I ever meet you. If it don't hang, then he can't bang. He can't hurt my feelings, but I like pain. Me and ask, who's is it when I rock it? Yeah, I'll spell my name. <laughs> yeah. In this house, there's some holes in this house. There's some holes in this house. This nigga doing the lean with his rock with it. <laughs> Bruh, I just don't understand on a serious note, like, why is people so upset with this? Bruh, I done sit down. Mm-hmm. Listen to Ready to Die and suffered through skits of Biggie fucking breathing exactly. hard as breathing fuck. Breathing hard, yeah. Make it sound asthmatic fucking. I mean, in skits. I don't understand why it's a big problem with this either because most women in rap have already did it. Right. Well, not, yeah. I mean, a lot of them, a lot of mainstream ones. Mm-hmm. I mean, the only one you can really think of that didn't go this route at some point that I can really think of is like. Lauren Hill. That's what I was thinking. Lauren Hill. Maybe Remy Ma. Remy Ma was more of a gangster. And if rapper. you want to go new school, Ella May. She hasn't ventured she ain't into a rapper though. But she's more of a singer. Mm-hmm. I don't know too many female rappers that haven't well, chosen. Singers this like what she say, Sierra. Mm-hmm. I mean, she kind of got like. She was more she of was, a dance. She was more Hers was more dancing. with it, but she wasn't out, outright freaky with it like like this. Other than this. if you can even go as far as having that ride it song, that's what it was. That was probably the most I seen. Bro, I ain't even gonna lie though. Something that threw me off when I was young, bro, mm-hmm. was when Aaliyah went freaky. I was like, "What the fuck is this?" I didn't even know Rock the Boat was by her, bro. I, I was surprised. That's yeah, that's a fact. But you know, I, I mean, wasn't offended, bro. I, was, I mean, shit, bro. She was dealing with that man. Now that was way after him, though. I mean, she still. That man was around, and everybody know that man that I'm talking about. So <laughs> but, we go, we go. We already talked about that enough. Yeah, she was with that man. <laughs> <I> mean, <I'm, laughs> she was with I, that I, man. I, just, I don't see what the fucking why is punk ass Fox News dudes. Is that dude from Fox News? I can't even remember his fucking name, bro. He mm-hmm. an asshole. Getting offended and senators saying that this is. Bad, uh, they being bad role models for children. Number one, first of all, if you're looking for Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion to be a role model to your children, that's already a, a no go. Shit. Yeah, man, it's a no go for for you to be looking for entertainers to be a role model to your child in the first place. And what kind of fucked up parent are you mm-hmm. if you knowingly let your child watch some shit like this? Right. That's a or even listen to the song. Oh, if they go behind your back, that you it. can't really control that. Man, but I'm pretty man. sure some kid asked to 
I seen this. I heard about this video. I'm gonna watch it. Bro, somebody told me about this shit. I ain't know what the fuck they was talking about. I was like, what? What the fuck is a whack? I knew it was out, but I didn't watch the video. I had no interest in seeing because I didn't think this was what it was gonna be. I thought this was just gonna be a normal, you know, run of the mill mainstream making a stallion Cardi B song. I didn't know it was gonna do all this. Uh huh. I like it. I think it's good. I love the video. Me too. A video. <laughs> Let's continue watching. Before I fuck up again. Who is this chick? Who is that one? I don't know. She comes back up. Who's that? I, one? I couldn't tell you none of these women's names. Yeah, that, I don't know who that is either, but uh, more power to you, Chicken the Stripes. Right. There's more. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right, she's a rapper. Man, I was trying to pause it on Megan Thee Stallion bouncing that ass. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Video was over anyway. Good split. Booty cheeks everywhere. Mm -hmm. that. Let's continue. All right. Overall thoughts on this, on the song itself. I think the song is great. It's some holes in this house. <laughs> it's some holes in this house. It's some holes in this house. Frank Ski just got paid. Mm -hmm. so, paid like a motherfucker. So, me, I think this song is great. Video is great. Everything about it is great. I ain't got shit else to say about it. I love to see booty cheeks and titties everywhere on the TV screen when I watch it. So Exactly. Now, what is your opinion mm -hmm. on the numerous videos I done seen of people talking about, dudes talking about, they don't like this shit because it's promoting thought activity and we falling for it? I don't I can't say what I want to say, but... Well, you're going to call them niggas gay? I won't necessarily going to say that <laughs> all the way. But I was going to say you might not like women. Uh -huh. There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. You can do what you do. I like women. I like seeing it. If you don't like it, don't watch it. It's easy. Bro, I, I just say, I put it this way, man. Mm -hmm. Everybody is entitled to have their opinion, right? Right. All right. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing wrong with that. If you don't like the song because you don't like the song, that's fine. And if you don't like the song because you think it's promoting thought activity, that's fine too. Mm -hmm. But you got to realize when you come on the, 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 the social media app of your choice and say this, you sound like a straight up bitch. <laughs> that's what you sound like to me. And that's my opinion about you. <laughs> that's what you know what I'm saying pointed at that nigga his face you <laughs> you that's what you do bro come on man what do you think bro do, do motherfuckers think that women is gonna hear this song and exert the power of the pussy over them nigga they been exerting the power of the pussy over us before Cardi B and them came out with this shit facts niggas be they, and niggas be getting haircuts Niggas be buying brand new cars. <laughs> Nigga, if it weren't for pussy, we would all be walking around here looking like Grizzly Adams riding bikes. Nigga, we wouldn't be. What the fuck is you talking about, nigga? But, uh, everybody loves this song. And even the presence of it on TikTok and, like, apps like TikTok and Triller. Fuck TikTok, bro. You know I don't know about TikTok. Bro. TikTok is amazing. Oh, TikTok is amazing. Right, we ain't bit, but it, of course, something like this is gonna blow up on TikTok because mm -hmm. you know, that's what TikTok is for. TikTok is for blowing up shit like this. Right. And let me see. Eighty-four million views later. Right? <laughs> Eighty-four million views. And this dropped on August seventh. In a week, I don't think they give a fuck if you don't like them promoting their thought activity. Nigga, keep on promoting it. I like it. <laughs> shit. Half the fucking women you motherfuckers probably been with was thoughts. That's a fact. We all been there. We all don't woke up and would like to have forgot what happened last night. <laughs> Nigga, 
nigga, we have done it. Don't pretend like you haven't. Uh oh. Somebody is getting lit up in here. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had the bottle of Henny. This would be a good one. But, uh... <laughs> that's, all, that's all I got to say about it, man. Like, I don't know why oh, people. Nah. He better not do it. He better not do it. Oh, shit. Gifts oh. <laughs> from the cameraman himself. Gifts <laughs> from the cameraman himself. Hey, bruh. We might fuck around and get a brand deal and shit. We hey. Keep it up. Hey. That's all we drink. Bro, we ain't fucking copying drink champs either. So don't be acting like bitches talking about we trying to copy Nori. It ain't what we doing. No. I, mean, we, I don't even drink. So fuck all that. So anyway. That's all I really got to say about it. On that promoting thought activity, this video was too raunchy. I mean, CeeLo Green, what the fuck are you even talking about? I Stop can't. It. You can't even say that because you had Little Kim and Foxy Brown. Oh, people was mad at Little Kim too, bro. Don't get it twisted. People, I was just. A I little mean, kid. I wasn't even around to see that, but I know it's there. And I was just a little Trina. kid, bro. Like, bro, Trina, bro. Let me tell you a story about Trina. Mm-hmm. I used to be watching the wackest bullshit songs that I would <laughs> never like in my life to just see her. Trina, bro. You couldn't get me away from the TV when "Take It to the House" by Trick Daddy came on the mm-hmm. fucking TV, bro. That's a fact. You couldn't get me away but from the TV for that shit. I don't think anybody should be mad. Or feeling any type of way about this because it's music. It's entertainment. You going to have it. This is going to happen. If it ain't Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion, somebody else was bound to come out with this video. I mean, or worse. Shit, the Nicki Minaj Anaconda video wasn't much off from this, from fact. what I can remember. That's a fact. I mean, I don't remember this is seeing the difference, no right? titties just out. Out the Puff shirt, old ass yes. was out though. Like, but this, I is, mean, this is with that song. Let me to tell you why it wasn't really an uproar that I don't remember. It. Why? It's because Nicki Minaj was rapping in that song about dicks. Facts. And this how is, she wanted to take one. These is women rapping about how they um, gonna put that pussy on you and fucking have you not under to mention, the spell, bro. Like that's what the it video is. with these lyrics are censored. This ain't even the real song. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, I don't care. <laughs> I don't know. Song, bro. Hey, man, fuck the song, bro. I just wanted to see the video. But the song sound good to me. It sounds it sound like, a, on a musical side, it sound like the, a product of the times. It don't sound Facts. no different than the Anything mainstream shit out. that continues to come out. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? It's just a little explicit. So what? Now, I heard more... More explicit stuff than this, though. On the subject of the petition to get Kylie Jenner out, mm-hmm. expand on your thoughts about that shit, bro. I feel like it's stupid for a lot of reasons. For one, it's just a video. It's not serious. She won't even in the video long enough to have like a specific role or even do anything that would have made an uproar happen. Mm-hmm. I feel like people is just bitching. They need to just no, shut up hate them. and just enjoy the video. People. But then again, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. I don't know. They might have a real diehard reason why Kylie Jenner should not be in this video. People hate I them. personally don't care. So I believe other people shouldn't care too. I don't think anybody should care because... You go watch this video for 4 minutes and 12 seconds. If you get through the 4 minutes and 12 seconds. And you, after that, you ain't got to watch this shit no more. Nope. You ain't got to do, you ain't even got to listen to fucking Cardi B no more. Nope. You ain't got to type this shit on YouTube no more. Something about Kylie Jenner though, right? Mm. I got a message from a man's Tiger. Mm. Tiger, you should be upset. <laughs> Tiger, you should be upset. Let me get closer to the mic. You know why? Because you suffered through all the Kylie Jenner looking like a, a fucking cardboard cut out of a stereotypical white girl. And you loved her through all that. And as soon as she got the ass and titties put on, she left your bitch ass. 
She left you when you wasn't having no motherfucking billboard chart and songs and all that. Just left you at your lowest point. Mm -hmm. Nigga, when she was reaching her apex and you was down in your fucking deepest valley, <laughs> nigga, she kicked you right up out the fucking crib and started fucking with a nigga that was on top of the top of the game. So with that being said, Tiger, you should be upset. Mm-hmm. At Tiger. At Tiger? At Tiger. At himself? At him. Oh, at him. Yep. Oh, you mean like some social media? Yep, shit. like oh, at Tiger. You should be upset, dog. <laughs> you should be upset, bro. It's like when like when we talked about her in relations to a car, bro. It's like if you had the motherfucking Audi or something. Mm-hmm. Nigga, and that shit was just a beater when you had it, and you trade it in, and then you see the next nigga with it, and he done hooked that motherfucker or, all the or way up. Or, I give you a better one. What's that? You driving around in your brand new Chrysler 300. <laughs> <laughs> Thinking, you the man. You the man. Paper tags and all. <laughs> and this nigga pull up beside you in a family. I mean, then you just gotta be like, Yo, Chrysler, nice. And that shit happened to me today, though. Mm-hmm. Nigga, I was I was driving my car and shit. Mm-hmm. Me and my cousin, bro, we driving our fresh ass whips. Facts. Nigga. Shits we just got. Our little five second walk down the hallway. Yeah, I don't know we had to cut because we fucked up. So this shit might be overdubbed, or it might be me saying walk down the hallway twice or something. <laughs> I don't care. Anyway, but it's fine. It's yeah. fine. It's yeah. gonna work. It's this gonna is work. the first video record, man. This is a test pilot episode of this. Right. This is our pilot, mm-hmm. and it's and it's Tiger. You should be upset. Tiger, you should be upset, but not too upset now because you back on top of yeah, you, got, you. You back doing your thing. But damn, bro, she ain't have to step it up this far after you, bro. She could have incrementally, nigga. She went full out, fucking. From zero to a thousand on niggas, bruh. And I don't zero to a hundred nigga real quick. People don't like the Kardashian mm-hmm. women slash Jenners. I don't know why. I don't give a fuck about them. I never think about them. Mm-hmm. But maybe they don't like them because they all because a lot of them bought their looks. I, I know at least Courtney, not Courtney. What's the tall one? Chloe. Chloe. She bought her looks, but. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> she look good as fuck now, bro. Like, <laughs> she, she don't look like the same person that was married to Lamar Odom. Facts. But I don't think I don't think niggas should really hate these videos, Kylie Jenner or anybody. Really. The video was entertaining to me. Facts. Like X rated Willy Wonka. X rated Willy Wonka. Mm-hmm. Anyway. So <laughs> we gotta condense this shit because you know we be going off on tangents and we ramble for hours about nothing yo Sometimes we argue, i ain't even gonna cap i'm about to ramble right quick about nothing okay so i going. got my airpod in right all right no cap we was just talking about the very x-rated willy wonka mm-hmm. and siri picked that up and now i got a search for very X-rated Willy Wonka. Brad, is you finna pull that shit up? I'm not. No, I, I didn't I don't go to it. See I didn't go to it. That comes from that fucking search, I'm just bro. saying. Siri be listening. Yeah, Siri be listening to you, bro. That shit. That's why when the fuck your ass talk about how much you like Pepsi, you see a million ads pop up on your fucking phone afterwards. That's a fact. Anyway, man. Like I was saying, we gotta condense this. We just running through it. Mm-hmm. This week is the reaction. And the little discussion about there's some holes in this house, there's aka some holes whack, in this house. Wop, there's some holes in this wet house. Wet and gushy, wet ass put whatever you want to call it. And now we're gonna get into some independent music reactions, man. That's what we're gonna do. First up, <coughs> Tsunami Dave, motherfucking dolphin. dolphin. You ready? I don't hit play on that one. Right, I, I need to hear that one right now. I haven't heard this all the way through yet. So this you haven't heard this all the way through? I don't know. I was busy and shit. Open your ears. Man, this nigga look like Reap. (laughs) 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 
Nigga had his hat on the same way today too, just like we did. We had a shit like that. <laughs> I'm a no risk taker, give me your arm, I need that And I step on the sink, it's a move I know you love me, you are a nerd I'm gonna take shit at my depression Come on up, baby, I'm gonna eat good I'm about to tip this shit, I'm gonna set I want my balls to it, I'm like, fuck my cop that dropped this song I'm talking about, baby, I was a tree She still can't get no fuck with another And I made a pee I took the fuck with the last one I took the last one I don't want to sell this girl with that It ain't no problem with me I swear to God, that shit I don't feel Want me to stick my dick in my back In the coffee Where you gon' be if you relax? We gon' all feel I don't know you wanna please be back I play for Boston Now I'm about my green, yeah, I need that And I don't wanna play with me Fuck the Adderall, got me quiet and relax I'm a known bitch, fuck her Ask my niggas, it's a fact I'm a known risk taker, give me your arm I need that When I step on the scene, it's a murder she act like a person. Say something about Gerber. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga Dave be talking his shit. He talk his shit. Let's, let's stop it. Let's stop it. About to play it again? No. Oh, okay, okay. It ain't fun. But the mouse turned off. The fuck. Anyway. Anyway, man, I fuck with that shit, man. That shit's fire. I fuck That's, with it. Dave ain't that really. That shit is fire. He ain't really put out no duds. Mm -mm. Especially not the ones we done listened to, bro. Come to your house and we take your luggage. And we go kind of the loop. I put that even fucking since new. Don't even get me started on that one, bro. bro I just crazy. like the fucking. I like the smooth flow of the songs, mm -hmm. bro. Like, and that beat with the singer sample in the back. Mm -hmm. I like the guitar on the beat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the smooth flow of and the that, songs that he put. And, and the hooks that that nigga be on is what really will catch you. Mm -hmm. Even the last one we did, the motherfucking... Um, issues? Issues shit. Thanks. Oh, I'm about to burn. Uh, false alarm. Anyway, back to it. This, The whole vibe of the song mm -hmm. is that one... Pop that out of raw. Got me quiet and relaxed. That's the whole vibe of the song. It sound like he was rapping on the fucking out of raw. That's what it sound like he was doing. But that ain't, that ain't a bad Dave's thing. A bro. That's it. That nigga Tsunami Dave is a goat. I, mean, I fuck with that shit, bro. I just like the... When you in that mood to hear something smooth, mm -hmm. relaxing. This is it. You driving in the middle of the night. Motherfucking street lights is on. Mm -hmm. You ain't going too fast, going 35 in a 45, my nigga. Facts. You just got this shit bumping, bruh. That's how I feel about it. Now, all we need is the whole tape. That's oh, all we need. I mean, he, he he got one coming. He does. Put out so much goddamn going fucking music. Like, <laughs> like, this nigga put music out all the fucking time. We can't even keep up with it all. We need that, though. But that was Dolphin, Tsunami Dave. Great song. Fire. Heat. Heaters. Whatever you want to call it. What's up, dog? It was great. Next. We got Wolf Morpheus, No Games, featuring Villboy Ram. Produced by Wolf Morpheus mm -hmm. and Yes, Jerron. Yeah, Wolf Morpheus, he a producer. And he put out a, basically a whole album. Mm -hmm. He produced the whole thing. Right. Called Frequency. We just reacting to one track today. But, but full review coming next week. Right. And that's why it took us a couple weeks to get this out. Because we was, you know, trying to get this video set up. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But he, he, he doesn't rap on any of it. But that motherfucker enlisted the elite of North Carolina rappers the to get elite. on this shit. Bro. The <laughs> elite. <laughs> that's what he did. The motherfucking Billboy Ram. You want to get it going? I need some sound on that one. I need some of that. I need that. All right. That's that shit. Here we go. No games. Featuring Billboy Ram, Bob Wolf Morpheus from the Frequency album. Yeah. Yeah. Ram. I need to hear this. 
I wanna see these niggas chill On a pill poppin' and still totin' Old words that I been spoken, they still potent I feel chosen, look up and see where the bill goin' Talk cheap, but niggas don't want beef when the grill's open I'm still smoking, no retarded can fix I bought with a chip on my shoulder, goin' hard as a bitch I know some young is armed with clips, take all of your shit Then lay you down for five of your back like they golf for the Knicks The cycle continues regardless of this, it always be the same Your mindset gotta rearrange to see a change, to see the fame these niggas sell they souls, still don't be ashamed It's funny we remain inside these chains, I cannot free a slave Can never miss in the clutch, I gotta manage the moment The camera's on, I stand alone as I damage opponents I sat at the throne and had the crown for your rap Was approaching a level of etiquette enough to come after the coldest I'm like Shaq with my back to you niggas, I'm catching the score And I can shatter the back of the board while I'm passing the boredom It's young round like I'm back in New Orleans But I'm still built to the date of my casket is ordered yeah, confidence higher than average Normal niggas be whacking they boring Versus be lacking importance Niggas be capping order to live a fake ass fantasy Life that a rapper was forced And niggas get whacked over Jordans Meanwhile, I know some niggas back in the trap With a quarter key finna rap it And push a pack to look after they daughter You niggas rat on your homie On a social media app They act as informant Shit getting sad and annoying Me, I'm on a different wave Craving a dapper persona Sipping yeah till I'm yawning I be on track in the morning After the aftermath for the horror after my aura, foreign exchange imported the crap from the border. Back when I squeegee floors, no Fiji when towel was the water. All this money piling around me, I act like a hoarder. Could never go back to the torture, scrapping the quarters. All praise be to God, I know that no man is immortal. Yeah. <laughs> we, ain't, we ain't even stop that bitch, man. We just let that whole bitch. Like, you had to. I got, I only got one thing to say. What's that? 10 out of 10. I'm done. 10 out of 10. That motherfucker said for an exchange, an exchange, I'm importing the crack from the border. I got to make sure I got that shit right. 10 out of 10. It's never been a time where Villboy didn't cease to amaze me with what he says. This nigga is the GOAT. One of <laughs> the most elite MCs out of Raleigh. I mean, not out of Raleigh, but out of North Carolina. I'm too good. Just a little bit. I, don't, I keep telling this motherfucker, man. Like, we fuck with you, J. Cole. Mm -hmm. You got this we, whole group of money makers in your backyard, you, man. We what the fuck, fuck are you doing? We fuck with you, J. Cole, in C. But, you got niggas like Billboard from your hometown that you ain't even. I don't know what I mean. What the fuck are you doing, man? Stop looking this all over Dreamville. the country for niggas. This is Dream. Go down there. It's a whole group of these motherfuckers. A whole right? group. It's a whole fucking. <laughs> and nigga, this is Dreamville right here. Go down the fucking aisle of your city that says hot ass fucking rappers <laughs> and pick one of them. Pick them all. Bro, they all right there, bro. We fuck with you. But maybe you need us to be your motherfucking A&Rs for Dreamville. Not to say that they ain't already got hot niggas over there. Facts. Because that one nigga, bro. What's his name? J.I.D. Motherfucker be going off. Yeah, I need to go. But but damn, you need to go and really look at these artists. Rock Nation got enough money to pay these niggas, right? Yeah, this but, is it's no reason that you telling me Billboard Ran shouldn't be spitting this everywhere. Anyway, back to it. Anyway, J Cole, Fayetteville, they can rap down there. All of them. They, yeah, we all of them. make beats, rap. The whole fucking night. rap steroids. This rap is, steroids. <laughs> <laughs> Injecting. I need a whole gallon of the water y'all are drinking that makes y'all rap. This shit like is this. heat, bro. It's fucking fire. We got some more Fayetteville music coming down the damn docket too, bro. Right. We got this album. We haven't listened to it yet. Mm -hmm. About to give it a listen. Mm -hmm. it's called Bleed with Me. Right. That one is gonna be coming soon. We gonna That's tell coming you soon. what we think about it. The review of this Wolf Morpheus album is coming soon. Yep. Next, Next week, episode. Whatever we get up here and decide to bullshit around about after we finish bullshitting around, That's we're going to talk about the music. We're going to do it. What With that being said, I don't really got much else to say. Wolf Morpheus, Field Boy Rain, Tsunami Dave, Dolphins, No Games, all that. Tiger. Cardi B. You Wham, should be upset. Tiger. There's some holes in this house. There's some holes in this house. And we out. <laughs>